Today I'm gonna to show you one simple strategy to get nutrition clients every time you post on social media. The secret is increasing engagement on the social media content you post, which comes down to using the one main strategy I'm gonna show you today. We'll start with the easiest way to do this, but make sure to hang around to the end of the video where I'll show you an example that landed one of my students 15 coaching applications from one single post. Want more engagement on your posts? The easiest way to start that is to get people to start liking your stuff. If you want more likes on your posts, you just need to ask. Here are my three favorite ways to do that in a caption say, Double tap if this hits home, like if you agree, or even let's see how many likes this post can get. Why do you want people to like your content? Well, it just doesn't make you feel good. Outside of the validation, getting more likes on the post pushes the actual engagement, which ultimately pushes the reach of your post, meaning more people actually see it. And when you're asking people to like the post, what you're doing here is using a call to action or CTA, which is the strategy we're gonna talk about today. A call to action or a CTA is a business term that invites the people that are viewing your work to take a specific action. When we write or design a CTA, we want it to be clear, focused, and have a few steps. And when used properly, it leads to more money, followers, and a community of supportive people that may turn into clients. You may be asking yourself, do I actually need to use calls to action? And the answer is a resounding yes. You need to use a call to action on everything you do. And not doing it is actually just flat out lazy. Because first of all, as a coach, you need to be guiding people to the next step. This is what builds authority and gets people to sign up for things. And using a call to action is what encourages someone that is reading or viewing your work to to do something. Not using a CTA is the reason why you're not landing more nutrition clients. You want to guide your potential clients and even your current clients to the next step. And here's a few more ways to encourage people to like your content. Double tap if you learn something. Like this post if you want to see more posts like it. Now getting people to engage does work better if you line it up with the right content. So if the outcome that you want is likes, it works best to line up a like driven CTA with a still post picture like a selfie or even a reel. This may be different if you want comments which is something we'll touch on next. Want to get people raising their hands showing their interest in a topic, ask them to share something with a comment driven CTA. Here's some of my favorites. Let me know in the comments if blank, or even a simple agree or disagree, yes or no. Drop a comment with the word blank and I'll send over the next step. Although this works really well on all platforms, it works particularly well on Facebook with those status updates. Check out this post. You promise something in the text and then tell people to comment something for the next step. Keep in mind every reply is another comment. So when they say yes or the comment, you can reply with mind if I send you a direct message and they say send it over, then you got three comments. I've seen those type of posts continue to get comments for months. At this point, you may still be wondering, do I actually need to use calls to action? Do I need to use them on my social media content and my email broadcasts and newsletters? And the answer is still yes, and it's the same reason you create action steps in your weekly nutrition coaching check-ins. Because you need to tell people what to do, especially if you wanna be seen and valued as an authority that can get people results. Now, if you want more direction on how to put this together in a caption, I have a completely free script that teaches you exactly how to do that. Comment script below and I'll send you over the completely free resource. Getting people commenting can be fun, especially with CTAs like, drop an emoji if, comment the fire emoji if blank, and you can even get people tagging their friends in the comments for more engagement. Tag a friend who needs to see this. Tag a friend you do blank with, as well as working in a more sales driven offer like this. Comment results below to be one of 10 people I personally coach in January. Now if the bottleneck in your nutrition coaching business is being seen by more people, you need to create some content that can spread and ask people to share it. So when you create content that other people agree with and can get behind, ask them to share it with a CTA like this. Share this with a friend who blank. Share if you agree. If this hits home, share it to your story so other people can benefit as well. Share this post for a chance to blank. One thing I do want to stress here is make sure that the CTA that you're using and what you're asking someone to do makes sense with the content. We're not going to ask someone to shop or buy on a platform that doesn't have that feature or with a piece of content that has nothing to do with purchasing. When it comes to sharing, in my experience, the voiceover type reels and Twitter style still posts seem to be the best to get in front of new eyes. And that's how to get more people sharing your stuff. Now keep this in mind, shares are great. But think about the story feature on many platforms. The post gets passed along and then it dies out. One way to keep people coming back to your content is to get them to save it. This is great for highly valuable content, mostly how-to or instructional content that people would wanna come back to and review later. Think about recipes and even carousel style posts where there's tons of value step to step and you're showing someone how to do something. Here's the exact CTA language I like to use. Hit that save button so you don't forget. Make sure to save this post for later. Don't forget to hit save so you can come back to review. Make sure to hit save for the next time you need blank. Remember how algorithms work. They want to keep people using their app. So if it knows a piece of content is so valuable that people want to save it, it's going to show it more. Now, if you're in a place that you want more eyes on your content, use some CTAs that'll help you grow. Like this, follow me for more blank tips and put your social media handle in there. If you found this useful, make sure to follow blank for more blank. Now, if you're trying to get people more curious about your 
coaching. You can get them to explore more by either getting them to go to a link or by going back to your profile to review something else. These work well. To learn more, go here. Go to my profile to check out my other post on blank or to start shopping, check out my website. If you're not feeling super confident about promoting something, use this CTA detail next. The postscript. Ah yes, the additional remark at the end of a letter. A nice way to leave something subtle. P.S. If you found this useful, feel free to share it. P.S. You might also enjoy this. P.S. Whenever you're ready, here are the two best ways I can help you. Now, if you don't want to be subtle and you're ready to go for the juggler and get people to buy things, you gotta set deadlines. Create some urgency with these act fast CTAs. Don't delay, do X now. Get immediate access by signing up now. Available to the first 10 clients who sign up, these urgent CTAs work really well. But finally, directing people to the outcome that we all want, which is getting them to sign up for nutrition coaching. Generally, to get new clients, we need to have a conversation with them or get them to go to an application to fill us in with more information. Since you can't use links for posts on platforms like Instagram, coaches have found a workaround by sending people to the one link that they can use, which is the link in their bio, which means we want to send people there and rack up some website taps. If you want people to go visit your profile and to click, you could write, go to the link in my bio to apply for blank. And this is the exact CTA that my client Noah used to land 15 paying clients from one post. Check it out here. In the caption, she talked about why she's so passionate about helping others and what's in it for them if they sign up, like losing 10 to 15 pounds before summer. And finally, what to do next, which in this case was filling out the form in her bio. And boom, people get the next step and the opportunity to reach out. Now for something more curiosity based, you could say something like, if that hits home, I have something to show you, go to the link in my bio. And if you were actually worried about if saying the words link in my bio would actually hurt the performance of your post, this has been studied. And actually a recent study on Hootsuite found that saying those words and actually included them boosted performance. Remember with this type of CTA, you're just trying to get website clicks. So people need to know that there's an actual opportunity at the link in your bio. I also love check out the link in my bio for more details and check out the link in my bio for more success stories. Now to make more money and to help more people as a nutrition coach, you need to get more engagement on your social media content. And we want to make sure what we're doing is thinking about what we want people to do. As of January, 2023, if there was a gold standard for engagement on a social media post, it would be website clicks. That is the most important thing. That means you're using a CTA that is directing people to the link in your bio to click on something. But then it's followed by saves and then comments and then likes. Ideally, as a coach, you're creating CTAs to get a balance of these outcomes. Make sure to measure how your CTAs are performing depending on what outcome you're asking for. And then recreate what is working best. Just like your clients collect data and double down on what performs well. Now, as great as all these tips are, if you're really serious about starting a nutrition coaching business, the next thing I'll have you do is check out the video I've linked up right here, where you can steal the entire social media strategy I use to land new paying clients. So make sure to check it out now and I'll see you in the next video.